with Wakanda Area Library. Today we are going to make this fantastic patriotic wind charm. When you come to the lobby and get your kit, you'll get a blue star, some string, and this is made with a paper plate. It's going to be fantastic hanging outside, blowing in the wind. So it's super easy. The star is already blue, so you don't have to color that. I painted this first one. So get out your ruler and get whatever you have. The second sample I'm gonna show you, we're just gonna use red markers. So anything, red paint, red markers, crayons, colored pencils to make the stripes. So at home, you're gonna need a hole punch, ruler, and some scissors. So first let's get our ruler. I didn't measure, just take it and draw some lines wherever you want. Doesn't have to be even because we're gonna cut it anyway. And you're not really gonna notice it when it's blowing in the wind. So it's gonna look like that. So I did one, two, three, four stripes. I am gonna color in this end one here. And I'm gonna do this one a little faster so you don't have to sit and watch me color. So these are while supplies last. Don't forget we're gonna be closed Monday on Memorial Day. So come in up until Sunday and pick up this fun craft. This will be, be our last craft in the month of May. And then I am already working on some fun stuff for summer. So we're gonna keep having the crafts in the lobby for you to take home and work on. And I'll have a bunch of summer themed fun craft ideas. And of course we're gonna have summer reading. So stay tuned for those details to keep your kids engaged and reading all summer long. So when you finish coloring, you're gonna want it to look like this. And then you're gonna take your scissors and it doesn't matter where you start, just pick a point and you're gonna cut it out like a snake. So just go up and all you're gonna do is keep cutting around and around until you get to the center. And then in the center, you're gonna to wanna to leave a circle and that's where you're gonna punch the hole. Keep going. I didn't wanna cut it too thin because I don't want it to rip it, rip apart while it's hanging outside. Keep going. And so it's about the size of the head of a snake. And then you see how it goes down in a spiral. And next, we are going to take your star and you'll punch two holes. So you'll do one in the top and one on the bottom. I just took a short piece of string for the top and the longer one I left there. You can cut it however you want. I gave everybody one piece of string Maybe you don't want to, you know, hang it by the top of the star. Maybe you just want to tape it and use the whole thing for the bottom. Just be careful. Don't get your hole punches. If you get it too close to the edge, it won't work. So be careful and get that kind of in the center. So now it's time to take your string and I will do it. The one hanging from the plate to the star and this one is for the top. So just take it and run it through. Like that. And we'll just knot it. Maybe some of you little ones might need some help with this, but the coloring will be fun. Do that and then run it through the bottom. And then of course, You'll need to punch a hole, do it right in the center of the plate. And 
and tie that. You can always add something else if you want to put some glitter on there or if you have some gold star stickers at home whatever you have to make it fun and that's it now we're going to go and hang it outside and watch it blow in the wind this is going to be a great addition to your american flag hanging outside so happy memorial day everyone have a safe, happy weekend, and I can't wait for the summer to begin. See you soon.